Hey friends, uh, I've got a little addendum to today's uh, post. Uh, it won't take long, but it's uh, it's important. And uh, I just thought I would share it with you. It turns out with uh, Jay's um, uh, ax handle, he put a letter in there too that I missed. So uh, I'm going to uh, show you this letter. Hello, my friend. This is the ax handle from my grandfather's three and a half pound felling ax. I believe it's from the 50s or 60s, and I don't think it was ever put into service. He had a couple the same. He must have liked them. He was in the forestry business, nickel miner, and had a small trapper supply store in northern Manitoba. Um, let's see, I, this is hard to do, so I'm just going to read it now. I've been holding onto this for 30 years now. He passed away when I was 13 years old. In that time, I've put a 28 inch handle on it and it has become my wedge banger. Every time I use it or look at it hanging in its place on the wall, I think of him and his hard work, never give up attitude. He taught me to work for what I need and want and never half-ass anything. Sorry, kids. I'm sure he would be proud that you are getting this handle and will preserve the history of ax handles. Hope you enjoy this piece of logging history and a piece of my heritage. Thanks, Jay Ferris. Dude. What, <laughs> what did you say to that? I mean, that's, that's precisely why I'm doing this crazy endeavor of axe handles and making axes is just because there's just something that I feel when I get uh, a big bow tie from up in Washington State or somewhere uh, up in Canada, Nova Scotia, or uh, gotten stuff from BC and uh, Vancouver Island and just on down all that logging country in Maine and just all over the place. There's just something, you know, I go and I look at the old logging pictures and it just speaks to me. Oh, and so do the dogs. This is our little girl who's coming out of her shell a little bit. We have one dog who's being an enormous grump to her, so we're having to keep them separated. But uh, anyway, getting back to this letter, Jay, what what can I say? I, can't, I, I don't really have any words. This, this is what Casterman Axis is all about. Um, that's, this is right here. This is, uh, it's the meaning behind the tools and what they did and, and how they improved not only America, but I mean, the axes go back to before recorded history. Um, go back to the video um, where I'm showcasing that ax uh, head that I found um, uh, from uh, basically the Stone Age, like the end of the Stone Age or such. Um, it's just, it's the quintessential uh, human tool of uh, human progress, I guess, you know? Um, so it, it's, it goes beyond just the American and the European axis. Um, This, this right here, is what this company that I've started is all about, is the history and the people that use the axes. Our grandfathers, our forefathers, are the people that came before us. So anyway, thanks again, brother. I'll talk to you guys soon.